Hey, what is up guys? Mr. The Reverts here and upon the craziness of COD content we're getting today, we got some information on a new type of weapon variant for Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Now, first and foremost, no, these variants are not stat changing. They do not alter anything in the game statistics of the weapons. Instead, they just give the gun a badass aesthetic look. I'm gonna have one on screen for you guys right here. These new types of weapons are called signature weapons and the one you see on screen is the signature weapon for the MX-9 and the way you unlock it is by buying the Digital Deluxe Edition, the Digital Enhanced Edition, or the Mystery Box Edition. But then it gets even better because after you unlock the signature weapon, then you have the option to complete other individual challenges in order to unlock additional cosmetic rewards for that same weapon. With the final being a Mastercraft version of that signature weapon. So there are signature weapons and then as you progress you unlock other different cosmetic changes to that same weapon and then at the very end you unlock the Mastercraft version of that gun. This sounds super super sick guys. Again this is all purely cosmetic changes. There are no stat changing variants or anything like that whatsoever and uh, so yeah this is very very cool guys. I assume every weapon will have a signature and Mastercraft version however I'm guessing you might have to unlock those challenges first to uh, to unlock the signature weapon first and that may be by prestiging the weapon or something like that I don't know that hasn't been clear to me um, but for the MX-9 again people who bought the special editions and uh, whatever the mystery box edition all those other editions I listed are gonna be able to have that MX-9 signature right off the bat so that's pretty dang cool um, for the people who do not buy those editions then you probably have to uh, unlock the signature weapon through like I said, I guess maybe prestiging the weapon or leveling up, leveling it up or something, I don't know. Um, but alongside this, guys, we have another type of signature weapon. I'm gonna have it on screen for you guys, and this is called the Divinity. This is the signature weapon for the Strife Pistol. And then after you complete the in-game challenges with the Divinity, then you unlock the Divine Justice. And man, look at that aesthetic on the gun. Like the gold, the white, it looks so, so sick, guys. But the way you can unlock this weapon is by pre-ordering the Pro Edition at GameStop. So that's the only way you can get this uh, day one uh, Divinity and the Divine Justice. You have to pre-order at GameStop. Now just a heads up, you can pre-order the Pro Edition at GameStop, thus giving you access to both of these signature weapons at launch, the MX-9 SMG and the Strife Pistol, um, which may be what I'm going to be doing after all because I did pre-order at Target, but like I really just want access to these two uh, signature weapons. Like The camos, the aesthetics, they look so so sick. And guys, every single weapon in the game is gonna have one of these. Like, that is absolutely amazing. Um, but then again, like, that begs the question, like, are we gonna have um, these type of variants in supply drops? Are we gonna be able to unlock these signature weapons by opening supply drops, maybe? I don't know. They're, they're just like a whole bunch of stuff such hammer, or such hammer, Treyarch can do with this game with cosmetic loot items. And uh, I honestly cannot wait to see what's gonna be happening, guys. So. If uh, you all want to read the full blog post that Activision posted about the signature weapons and the challenges, the rewards, I'm going to have a link to that down below in the description, guys. Uh, but tell me your thoughts about these weapons in the comment section down below. Do you guys like them? Do you guys think it's a good idea? Again, I really want to know your thoughts about this in the comment section. Also, drop a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. And thank you so much for watching, guys. We have a few weeks until the Blackout beta is finally here. And then next month, man, that's it. Black Ops 4 is pretty much here. And uh, so, yeah, get ready. I I am hyped. I cannot wait for this game. Thank you for watching, guys. I love you all so, so much. Till next time, I'll see you later.